so hello guys how are you all i'm hoping you are all doing good and then today we have a job update from hp and it is a software qa engineer and the job location is hyderabad and if we scroll down and look at the responsibilities of this role you should be collaborating with the developers product managers and other stakeholders to define the test plan test cases and quality goals from this first line you might know what this role is all about this is like a testing role where you will be testing the product and identifying the bugs and uh, reporting it to the developers and you will be uh, you will be executing the established test plans and protocols for assigned portions of code for end user application system software firmware running on hardware local networked internet based platforms identifies logs and debugs assigned issues so you will be assigned with the work uh, where you will have to find the bugs and you will have to test those things and if you find any bugs you will be actually reporting it to the software developer as i said in the first point uh, the third thing is you will have to design implement and execute the automated test scripts for functional integration and regression testing and also you need to develop the understanding and the relationship with the internal and outsource developed partners on software application design and development then you will perform a manual uh, testing to identify the platform issue and validate the new features and uh, you will be establishing and maintaining the qa processes and documentation and then you will be monitoring qa metrics and identifying the trends to improve the testing efficiency so these are the things you will be doing basically like a testing job where you will have to do the documentation you will have to identify the bugs validate the new features you will have to track and report and then uh, you will have to advocate the quality across the development life cycle such things such things are your responsibilities scroll down we can see here that what they are actually expecting from you uh, like who you are so simply you should have a bachelor's or master's degree in computer science information systems or equivalent so bachelor's degree is undergraduate and the master's degree is postgraduate typically you should have a zero to two years of experience and in the next knowledge and skills the same uh, thing is mentioned where you need to have a zero to two years of experience as a qa analyst or a similar role in software development and then you should have experience creating and executing the test plans test cases and tracking the defects and you need to have a strong knowledge of qa methodologies tools and processes then also experience in test automation tools and frameworks for example selenium cypress and playwright and then you should be familiar with the cloud and on premises virtualization environment and it is highly desired for you and a strong problem solving skill analytical skill and excellent communication and collaboration skill and yeah in, in every video we are telling about which are the keywords and skill you can actually add in the resume so uh, in this we will tell you few things where uh, you should know the qa methodologies tools and processes you can actually search in internet which is frequently used and if you know those tools you can actually add in your resume and also the automation tool and framework such as selenium cypress and playwright and then are familiar with the cloud so azure aws uh, ibm and then we have google there are lots of cloud providers so, and you need to know the those uh, cloud platforms like you need to uh, look into what platform hp is using so you will have to identify if whether it is google uh, aws azure or ibm or anything uh, so you will have to know those things and also about the on premises virtualization so little bit of networking skills is also uh, decided here so and if you know those things you will have a higher value in for this role and you will uh, get shortlisted uh, easily if you are looking for the link you can find it in the description and if you found this video helpful hit the like button subscribe and share it to your friends